Share the national moi moi. Divide the national cake. If you chop your own, I chop my own. That is what is ongoing in Nigeria. A senator in Nigeria has confessed that they are giving them a whopping 500 million naira each as a senator. I will leave you to watch it. On these issues and coming up with issues of the budget and individual uh, issues concerning what came to our various constituencies. If we want to go into those issues, all of us are called people. Some senators here, so-called senior senators, got 500 million each. I am a ranking senator, I didn't get. Did I go to the press? Most of you got. And, yes, if we want to go into those issues, excuse me, if we want to go into those issues, yes, so I think that, I think that, I think that Senator Ningi, Senator Ningi, there is nothing like it is their constituency project money. It is money meant for their constituents. Now lie. Pure lie. Constituency project money only exists on papers. Realistically, the money is for looting. Looting, they loot it. Where is the project? Where is the constituent? What are the things they have done? Stealing the money. Steal the money, share the nation. Share the goddamn cake and share the money. What is their business? None. This is how they are sharing your national cake. Off the mic, off the mic. That is what I'm hearing. Why is this senator exposing our secrets? And this is more secrets compared to many secrets they are keeping. This is why it will be very difficult for Nigeria to have a viable economy. I promise you that. They don't do any other thing. All they do is to share the money. Share the national cake. Share the national moi moi. There are people making excuses for these senators. I'm hearing it is normal constituency allowance. Don't make excuses for them. 500 million naira is a change compared to what they are stealing. They don't do any other thing. That is why you see them sitting with their bloated stomach. They don't have passion for leadership. Have you also seen why they can do anything to be called a senator and a, an honorable member? What do they do in the red and green chambers? Nothing, I assure you. Nothing. No passion for nation building. They do not love Nigeria and they don't love Nigerians. That is why it will be very difficult to get hospital in Nigeria. Because what they do is to sit down and share the national cake. How many senators do you have in the upper chamber? And how many honorable members do you have in the lower chamber? Calculate the both of them. Add the ones that they give them pocket money, five five hundred million naira times your senators, uh, also add it to your honorable member. The money is finished. They share money. They don't love you. Hospital you will not see. Good road you will not see. Jobs you will not get. Your boys, your children will turn to Yahoo Yahoo. The, their leaders are criminal minded. You continue making excuses for them. They are ruining the future of your children, your generation. Your 30th generation, they will still implant their children to continue stealing and looting. And in their criminality, they will continue from where their parents stopped. They are going to ruin you. Look at it. He is saying it himself. I'm not the one making up the story. They share 500 million naira. They share money. All they do is sharing money. Forget all this excuse of it is their constituents allowance. It is their project allowance. There is no project. There is no project, my brothers. There is no project, my sister. It is sharing. Sharing and looting. That is all they know. The only language they understand is share the national moi moi and divide the, the goddamn cake. Divide the goddamn cake. Let us eat our own share. Any opportunity they have to stay in government. Nah, you don't have free money. What is government of Nigeria? Government of Nigeria is enter there as a lazy man, steal your own share, you might not have another opportunity to eat money again. Just steal the one you can eat for another 50 to 100 years. Also steal the one your children will eat. That is all they do. Government of looting for criminality and for extortion. They don't know nothing else. You understand? They are ruining your children. They are ruining your children with their fat, bloated stomach. These are lazy people. Lazy men. You know they can't do any business and sustain that business. 
um, politics money is free money. It's free food. Why are they senators? Because everything is free. Free food. Free car. Free hospital. Everything is free. They get everything free of charge. Free money. How about? Free money. That is what they are getting. So, whatever you are facing in Nigeria, no consign them. As far as they know, be their children, they suffer around. Whatever you are passing through in Nigeria, it does not touch them. Because they are not the ones suffering it. No passion for leadership. No passion. No passion because all you have seen and all we are still seeing is criminals. Criminals have occupied the sensitive post. Why they are stealing from you and depriving you of basic amenities. They are teaching their children to also steal from your own children and deprive your children basic amenities. How they will steal from your children. Loot from your children and finally destroy the future of your children beyond repair. They are teaching their children criminality, tea free, and ex convict business is a serious business, a lucrative one for that. Criminals are ruling you, ex convicts, miscreants. These guys are parasites. Hello, that is why they cannot build road. Money for road, they loot it. Money to provide jobs for your children is for looting. Money to get you good hospitals, viable economy, don't forget that. Everything is for looting. They borrow money and they share it. I hope you know that bandits are also asking for their own money. 40 trillion naira. We're going to come to that. It is all over. Nothing is going to come out of a contraction.